Okay, how to play the chords of Hallelujah. Okay. The introduction Leonard Cohen starts like that, so you have a C major and a D. But uh, sorry, G. But what I do with C major is you add that at the bottom. So you're using all your fingers for it. Okay, can you see that? Third there, little finger there, third finger there. Okay, and then for your G, you're doing a G7, so it's like normal G, but with on your third string, you're putting your little finger on the third third fret of the D string. So I think it's important in the guitar to use bass strings as much as you can, uh, especially with a song like this. Leonard Cohen's got a very bassy voice, and it kind of brings out that nice feeling of the song. So the introduction is two chords, and then he starts growling away. Two chords there, A minor, and then F, and then G, that shape, G7. Make sure the C's got all of them, and then back to the, the verse. G to A minor to F and stay on F G and then the most important chord is E major and then back to then you're back to the F and then to the C uh, sorry A minor second time is this chord and then C major those chords now at full speed. Three, four. versions on YouTube where people are going E minor. I don't think it's E minor. I think it's E major. Definitely. It resolves the whole thing in a very uh, nice way. Now there's another variation of, of it where you go strings you play it there and use and use the bass as well it's a really nice sound also you're up on this fret so you can do the melody as well so C shape effectively which is F play the second version uh, full on okay so why don't you play along to these chords as best you may and then just go back and repeat until you've got it absolutely right and try and make it sound really nice make these chords really full and sing out you can work out your own kind of um, right hand technique um, this is a suggestion so here goes okay we'll work, work on the second version of hallelujah with the major left and so forth but going up to this chord up here okay.
to this part. Pick out the melody, so. yourself or you're accompanying somebody else, you can use those uh, ideas as a melody to put into the piece or as an introduction or to help the singer get those, uh, get those notes as well and it sounds very effective. So good luck, I hope you enjoyed uh, those chords and happy playing and enjoy this wonderful piece by Leonard Cohen. I think the original by the great master is by far the best, so if you're going to learn this song, go back to source, go to Leonard Cohen, look at him do it live, or listen to the studio version and you will hear all these chords c coming through loud and clear. It starts off in this tonality with C, you can put a bar in here, um, here's my capo, you, if your voice is better up here you can put your capo there and use the same chord. Or you can go right up to here, as some people do, and that's absolutely fair. some help to you. Thank you very much. See you soon.